Hi, Shave Culture Outcast. I shaved. I don't know if you noticed or not. The reason I'm making this video is because I decided I wanted to shave my beard. The problem was I didn't want to buy a Gillette razor. I don't know if anybody else remembers, but Gillette, Gillette made a commercial a few years ago that was designed to piss people off and get people to talk about them. So I bought this razor. Uh, the company is S-C-H-I-C-K. I pronounce it Schick. You can, you get the razor. I got one with, that comes with two replacement heads. You can get one that comes with 14 replacement heads. They also make a shaving cream. I like this better than Gillette's. That stupid that blueberry jelly crap that they that put in the can and you rub it on your face and it foams up and it feels good. It feels kind of good and it works, but it's, Gillette's overrated. They're, they're like the, kind of like the sand disc of, of the shaving industry. They're just overpriced, they're overrated and overpriced. And this, this was, this was about, I thought, I believe I got this on sale for about $14. It, it's not, a, it's not as expensive as Gillette. It's a very good racer. This is a very, very good racer. Also, I bought some new scissors. These little, these little scissors, little old fashioned kind of barber looking scissors. I shaved my beard down. If anybody sees an old video, you can see my beard is, it comes down about here. So I had to take these scissors. I took these scissors and shaved my beard down to, to stubble. I made it all, you know, that fat guy stubble beard that most fat guys have to hide their fat because they're fatty, fat, fat, and don't want to, don't, don't. Anyway, that's a different video. So this, this little razor shaved off all that stubble without ha without an electric razor or nothing. This this little razor got it. Whew. That's a this a this a damn good razor. I I need to shave now, but I, I don't I don't I, I don't want to. So I'll put a link in the description.